Beatrice is ordering pizzas for a party. Each pizza is cut into 12 pieces. Beatrice wants to have enough pizza so that each person can have four pieces. Can have four pieces. And 16 people will be at the party. A lot of information in this problem. If Beatrice buys seven pizzas, she buys seven pizzas, how many extra pieces will there be after each person eats four pieces? So to do this, let's think about how many total pieces she will have. And then let's think about how many total pieces will be eaten by the 16 people. And then we'll figure out how much that she had extra. So first, let's think about how many total pieces. And I encourage you to pause the video and, and try to figure it out yourself. She, has, she ordered seven pizzas. How many total pieces are there going to be? Well, you have seven pizzas. Seven, that's the number of pizzas. Number of pizzas. And if you, have, if you have 12 pieces per pizza, you multiply by 12 to get the total number of pieces. So this is number of pieces, pieces per pizza. And 7 times 12 is equal to 84 total pieces. Total, total pieces. So that's how many pieces she's got. Now let's think about how many get eaten by the 16 people. So you have 16 people. 16, that's the number of people. Number of people. And this little symbol, that's shorthand for number. 16 people, and they each eat four pieces. So 16 people times four pieces per person. So number of pieces per person. Pieces per, per person, 16 times 4 is 64. So that's 64, not 84, 64, 64 pieces are eaten, are eaten by the 16 people. So how much does she have left over? Well, if you start with 84 pieces and 64 get eaten, 84 minus 64 is 20. So you have, you have, we deserve a drum roll now, you have 20 pieces 20 pieces that are going to be, or 20 extra pieces after everyone eats their share.